You look gorgeous today. Thanks. What are you wearing? Uh, Ted Baker. Amazing. I've been doing so much to get ready for the Golden Globes. I've been, you know, wearing my heels around my house. I'm, I've been really silly because I've been like walking in these giant Jimmy Choo shoes and doing laundry and washing the dishes just to, you know, make sure my feet are ready for the night. I think there's going to be a mix. I'm definitely going to do a little bit of it alone. But my dad is going to be with me on the carpet, and so is my older sister, Spencer. So I'm very excited to kind of have that and to share this moment with my family. Yeah, we don't put any restrictions on anybody. That's what the Golden Globes is about. Anything can happen. So we'll just sit tight like everybody else and see what happens. A lot of big things to look forward to, but yeah, two two of the big ones are meeting Tina and Amy and, and getting to hopefully, fingers crossed, meet Reese with us. A huge, huge Reese fan, so I'm really, I'm hoping she wins. You want to give us a sneak peek of what you're going to wear to the Golden Globes? I'm keeping it a surprise, but I can say that my dress makes me feel like a princess always good and there might be a little bit of some sparkle on there. What does being Miss Golden Globe mean to you? Well it's such an honor. I mean this title has been going on since the 60s. I mean it's something that's been a long-standing tradition and it's so exciting to, to be a part of it and to be included on that list of girls who have gone on to have amazing careers themselves so it's just it's a really big honor and I'm so excited for the night and I'm so honored that I was chosen to be Miss Golden Globe this year.